are back. A laser treatment originally designed to keep your skin looking youthful is now being used to help millions of people who suffer from dry eye. This is really, really cool. Dr. Rolando Torres is here this morning to explain how this beauty breakthrough is now being used in his eye clinic. He's joined by patient Beverly Reardon. This is about dry eye, right, doctor? Yes. It seems like uh, every time I come here, it's uh, <laughs> something exciting and new. And it's been, a, yeah. it's been a couple of years. Now, so. for those who don't know, what is dry eye? Yeah. Dry eye, basically your uh, eyes are constantly producing a tear. Uh, and that tear lubricates the eye uh -huh. so that you can blink normally. Uh -huh. And it also gives you visual clarity. So why is it such a big problem when as we age, and I assume some younger folks have problems with it as well, the tear ducts don't provide as much tear? Yeah, basically this is a huge problem. They're saying, they're estimating about 12% of people in the country suffer from some form of dry eye. Is it painful? A and it can be painful. What it is, your tear is divided into three parts. Uh, a protein layer, a watery layer, and a fatty layer. The okay. fatty layer is what keeps your tear on your eye. If you didn't have a fatty layer, your tear would evaporate in a second, so we'd all be blinking every second. And there's some glands that produce that uh, fatty layer, and those glands are right on the eyelash margin. They're called the meibomian glands. And most people that suffer from dry eye suffer from gland dysfunction. Most of the things that we've had over the years to treat dry eyes just kind of artificial tears. Mm -hmm. So it's relieving the symptom, but it's not curing the problem. So over the years, we've been trying to find different ways to stimulate these glands to work normally so uh, patients wouldn't have to rely on just uh, artificial tears. That makes a lot of sense. Doctor, in very simple terms, let's talk about this new revolutionary procedure. How does it work? Basically, it's a flash lamp of light that uh, uh, is in the visible light range and infrared light okay. range. And we put a special filter to just to get the light that we want that will stimulate the gland. Let's go ahead and show some things. And we have to put actually protective glasses Everybody on. Everybody has to put protective glasses on. In fact, our crew on. is all wearing protective glasses. Because on. is this light, is it the infrared range that's dangerous? Uh, yes, but we're not going to be in that range. The okay. filter will filter all the way down close to the visible uh, light range. Now, can okay. we keep these glasses afterwards? Because uh, they look so cool. It's a fashion statement. <laughs> OK, yes. yeah, all right. <laughs> so, look up for me this when we talk about laser is this the same sort of laser that we typically associate with uh, trying to stay looking like 25 30 yeah and that's how we originally found this connection we had an aesthetics clinic where we were doing facial rejuvenation and when this first came out you know in 2000 that's what it was used for it was used for treating acne treating rosacea and facial rejuvenation and what we found is when we would apply this uh, intense pulse light the patients mm -hmm. who had dry eye would come back and go oh my dry eye is better wow so we applied for a research grant with the american society of cataract and refractive surgery they gave us a research grant and we've been studying this for the last five to six years what's exciting and why i'm talking about it now is that the technology and the way we use it to treat patients has come a long way since the early stages and now I'm training other doctors on how to do this procedure. And we're talking about doctors not just from right here in Memphis, from <laughs> across the nation, across yeah. the world, are we But not? you're yeah. teaching them, yes. right? So this all started this in your This all clinic. started in our, in our clinic. That is so cool. And uh, over the last year, I've been training doctors in Beverly Hills. It's a very, in L.A., uh, dry eye is a very serious problem. So Why the last in year LA? I've been training. Why in L.A.? Is the sun or the yeah, lack of Yeah, because of the dryness, the, the humidity is, is different. It's very dry atmosphere, and you have a lot of patients that with bad glands and that kind of atmosphere wow. suffer from dry eye. And actually, I've had patients visit me from uh, all over the world to our Memphis clinic and to that Beverly Hills clinic to get treatment. Which is the case for right. Beverly as well. Yeah, that's I? how I met Beverly. Why don't you go clinic. ahead and tell us what you're doing. Walk us through it a little yeah. bit because we only have a couple of minutes. Okay, so how the flash lamp uh, works is uh, to stimulate these glands is uh, uh, there's blood vessels that are secreting inflammatory mediators to the gland and choking off the gland. Okay. This visible light closes off those blood vessels and lets the gland work normally. Okay. okay. Can you show us why? Yeah. What you got? And we're ready to go. So. Now Beverly has told me she's had three treatments, or this is her third treatment. Is this correct? Correct. Um, how many treatments typically does it take? Does it? It usually on takes four treatments over a course of four months. And basically, I'm just going to give you an example of a treatment there and you can okay. see so basically we treat from ear to ear and we treat uh, two times and uh, are you feeling any pain or anything no. now what are you you're over on the cheek is that where the gland is 
the gland is right under the eyelid, but we found there's feeder blood vessels that are coming from this whole area here. Yeah. So if you just treat the lid, then those feeder blood vessels come back and then you get the dry eye sooner. Doctor, we have about a minute left here. Uh, is the procedure pretty lengthy? How much time does it typically it take? It usually takes about 20 minutes. Okay. After I do the procedure, this light works as a warm compress. So you've had a sty before. A sty yeah, right. is these glands that secrete the tear film. Right. So what we do is right after we do the treatment, that warmth from this uh, intense pulse light kind of liquefies the hard secretions in that gland, and then I start working on the glands to get expression. Can you notice a difference very quickly? Does it take a few days, a few weeks? Right away, we can get the warm compress effect of the IPL. So uh, we get an immediate effect, and then over the course of those four months, then we get the long-term effect. And then patients come for maintenance treatment uh, once a year. Right, just to keep the glands. And Beverly, on a scale of one to 10, if you were a one before, where are you now after three treatments? Um, after three treatments, um, oh gosh. Total improvement? Great improvement? A lot of improvement. A lot of improvement. A lot, a lot of improvement. That makes a great here statement in there. Memphis, right here. We are groundbreaking. All the information on your screen to find Dr. Toyo's clinic. All right, Beverly, there. thank you. Doctor, thank Thanks. you very much. Thanks for having me again. Thank Excellent you. work. Appreciate it. And we, we feel right kind of Hollywood. Here I like morning. the look at you. I like it. I like it. We'll be right back.